Our parsha begins that Hakadosh Baruch Hu tells Avram Avinu, "Lech lecha me'ar tzucha u'me'lat tzucha el ha'aretz hashel reka." And this is one of the great tests of Avram Avinu. The Mishnah in Pirkei tells us that Avram Avinu has ten tests. According to the Rambam in Pirush Hamishnah, is there. This is in fact the first test. Others learn it's a later test. But either way, it's one of the great ten tests of Avram Avinu's life. The difficulty is, what is so hard about it? HaKadosh Baruch Hu promises him three very wonderful blessings if he goes. Says the Pasuk, which Rashi explains means that he's going to have three wonderful brachas. If he stays here, he won't have a family. He goes, he'll have children. He here, he won't, he will struggle financially. There, he'll have momoin, he'll have tremendous wealth. And lastly, al Hashem, regarding his name, he'll be famous. So if HaKadosh Baruch Hu is promising him that he'll have family, fortune and fame, who wouldn't go? What exactly is the test? Many Mepharshim explain that the test is to go not because you want family, fortune and fame, but to go because HaKadosh Baruch Hu told you to go, to do it L'Shem Shamayim. And that is really hard. Because even though at the back of your mind you know that you're going to get these blessings if you do listen to Hashem, to do it for those motives is very tempting. But to do it L'Shem Shamayim, totally altruistically, is a very lofty level. I remember years ago when I was in school, we had a legendary math teacher, Mr. Jack Aldman, Olaf HaSholem. He was a wonderful man, son of the late Rab Nossen Aldman, who was the Rosh Shiva here in Eitz Chaim in London. And he used to say, what is harder? to eat for the mitzvah viti on Erev Yom Kippur or to fast on Yom Kippur. And of course, most people will think eating on Yom Kippur, who doesn't enjoy that? So that's a much easier mitzvah. Fasting on Yom Kippur, no one particularly likes fasting. But he would say it's actually the reverse. When you're fasting on Yom Kippur, there's only one reason why you fast. You fast because HaKadosh Baruch Hu told us not to eat on Yom Kippur, to fast. But when it comes to eating on Erev Yom Kippur, we all enjoy kreplach in, uh, with the chicken soup and all the other foods that we eat on Erevim Kippur. But to eat on Erevim Kippur, l'shem the mitzvah, l'shem shemaim, that's already a high level. To fast on Yom Kippur, l'shem shemaim, that's the only reason why we do it. And that really was the test of Avram Avinu. To do the rots nashem, lech lecho me'artzecho, but to do it not for the brachas that Kodesh Baruch assured him, but to do it purely l'shem shemaim.